Okay, here we go. We are walking in through the main lobby. That is the entrance to the auditorium section that is connected to all parts of the school. There is a waiting area here, or sort of like a lobby space here, which is what we've used in the past for ticketing. I don't see the light switch, but I'll see if I can get that on. Kyle, can we get the light on in, in this room okay, too? So I want to be able to show this room. And, um, Chris and this Kana is the auditorium the space so I'm walking you guys that we discussed. And, uh, Jer um, the stage. Is recording everything also. So this, is the recording. this is the control center. And, um, Yes, it's like everything that needs to be done, and then we'll break it down to yeah. what, we'll, what we're going to do, and then what you guys have to do. Yeah. Chanel, okay. if you could walk ahead of me and turn the lights on. Carlos, turn the yeah. lights on. Oh, so what type of floor is this? Is this just some... It's concrete stained. Concrete. It's stained, stained concrete. concrete. Yep. Nice to be yeah. painted. We were talking about... I'm the one that actually hired the guy to stain it, so I can call him and have him redo it. So, so you have your two... And we just came to the entrance. The second room outside and the lobby. And this is the walkthrough area that Kyle did, I mean, that Chris did when we came through for auditorium when he was here. Yeah. Okay, so this is from the auditorium's view. Um, for that, uh, and then you turn the lights on? I'm trying to get the lights on. No, this is, this is what's the high school. Oh, this looks so, like yeah, so when you walk into this room off the auditorium, this is a classroom here. It's actually. This is the way we came out of the building. We're doing it back into the reverse. Right, I got it. I got it. Okay. So here's another room. That's a classroom. I actually taught in that classroom. <laughs> this is the room that we use for the kids. It has a window glass on the door. There's another classroom here. This is a big one. Again, if you notice, there are no sinks in here. I know we're going to need to have a sink. So something to think about. There will need to be a sink in here. Uh, yeah, that's Chris. I know. I'm text Chris. I'm not. I'm not even gonna find her. Okay. There's another classroom. Another big size classroom here. It already has a whiteboard on there. High ceilings, as I stated before. Yeah, there's other rooms. Got it? Got it? Yes. There's another smaller classroom. Yeah, I have the floor plan too. There's another one over here. Floor plan, and I'm writing it down. Oh, okay. Uh, they can read the floor plan. Me, I needed to see if I know, so. It's all good. It, it was usually on the outside right here, but. I flipped it, it's not working. This one right here. It's not working. Okay. Okay. What are these? They were like storage rooms. We use this to put the server, like all the server. So, yeah. Well, this was the room. So this, this booth, you see all those piping wires there? It's, we had it all wired to this room right here. So from this room, we can control the cameras, the internet, the sound, the stage, everything. Right, so the guy downstairs. Mm -hmm. That's the tech, yeah. Wiring. On here, I wrote auditorium two clothes. Yep. Okay, so this is back to the front lobby entrance. This is where when we use this space, we would use this aspect for ticketing. Okay, this is right outside the lobby. This is where I would do ticketing and concession. So when I had this space for my past client who owned this place, that's what we did here. Okay. And in this lobby, we were able to put 438 chairs. Okay. okay. Now, this door here goes to the administrative side. This door here goes to the hallway with additional classrooms. And the third door at the end, past the pole to the left, and between Kyle and the pole, that's the restroom. Okay. But let's go through the administrative side now, so I can show you sort of like the school vibe of it. Okay. Yeah. And then after that, we'll come around and we'll go behind the uh, we'll go behind the stage. So now, remember, I said this side was the this behind this wall was the. Uh, yep, you got it. 
So now there's some classrooms here. There's that smell again. I'm, I'm gonna need that to be mitigated. That's mold. There's one classroom yeah. that's very molded. So this is, this, this room right here was an office. Um, we'll probably have to use this to store the chairs when we're not using them and stuff, you know? Okay. But yeah, there's well, this like would be like a big storage room. And there's smells a little bit like mold over here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, Kyle, remember, um, Chris, remember when we were there last time? I'm sorry, Kyle, let's yeah. say Chris. Yeah. That we're in those same two rooms. Remember we found the water drops? Oh, so, we didn't have a water uh, vacuum. Yeah. Here's this other classroom. This one that smells really bad. I don't want to yeah. stay in here too yeah. much. This is one yeah. similar water damage. Yeah. 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 Here's the other. Here's the other classroom. This classroom it has an egress into the lobby of the. See that emergency door is the lobby entrance for the uh, auditorium. But this is another classroom that we had here. Gotcha. Yeah, it smells yeah. over here too. Yeah, these two rooms had water issues. Like you could see. Look. Mm -hmm. You see the water stains. Mm -hmm. So. It's easy to fix. Okay. Now we are going. There's another classroom here. This is a really big classroom. We use this as a technology classroom or robotics lab. This is a big one. So. Mm -hmm. All right, so when you come down this hallway, this is the administrative office. It, it auto locks, so I don't know, but this is where you put brand new tile in. I flipped out when this guy put this tile in here. Oh, careful. Don't let it close. Yeah, just don't let it, don't let it, don't let it close. Just, okay. Turn it down. Yeah. I don't think that's going to work. Yeah, that's what it was. No, it slides. Just block it. Yeah. No, here. Oh, they get rid of it. Oh, okay. Yeah. So this is the administrative office. Okay. This is where we highlighted trophies and all that stuff. We have the sitting area, reception okay. desk over here. And there's a conference room in the administrative section with offices. Is there a flick, flick out there? I think it's on this, uh, this side. Oh. So as you can see, yes. no, no, these are offices. Office. This is administrative. Holy, holy torture. Yeah, I was gonna say these are just the office space. Yeah, here's another office here. here one, two, three. This is where Dr. Nelson's office was. So, and then this is the, this was the conference room. This also acted as the green room when we did events. That is literally the conference table I donated to the school, by the way. <laughs> That's my old conference table I donated to the school. <laughs> That's weird. I didn't think it was going to be here still. <laughs> if it's good, good one. No, not? it's good. It's a good oh, one. Yeah. It was heavy. It's good. So, uh, painting needs to be done here. Patch yeah. holes. Patch holes, painting. painting. So, this is the administrative yeah. section. Yeah. This, was, this was the, pre this was the uh, preschool director's office. This was actually Dr. Mills' office, Debbie. That's the lady who's currently the vice chair of the school board. Yeah. I'm on the board of one of her nonprofits. Oh, okay. So she said she's gonna help us as much as she can. She's really excited. Cool. Okay. You heard that? <laughs> so, and this is the administrative office. Okay. Isn't it nice? Because we told me before we build it, this is good. Another exit. White painting on the all right, so now we're going to go down the hallway of the additional classrooms. And then I'm also going to show you, um, Chris, remember I was telling you about the indoor playground opportunity, Debbie? Yeah, there's an indoor playground opportunity that I want to do because the landlord is saying they need um, half of that playground space. So I'll show you that when we go outside. You guys have another big classroom. Space. The basketball court's going to turn into parking. Yes. But we have to be mindful, the parking lot has to be a certain feet away from the playground where the kids are playing. So we gotta also right. keep that in mind, well, licensing wise. Well, it's fenced in, the playground. Huh? It's fenced in the playground. Okay, yeah. Yeah, this smells like some water. Yeah. Yeah, ammonia. You feel it? You smell it? Mm -hmm. You smell it? They're gonna have to go home. Oh, no, you'll see. 
there's gonna have to be a mold mitigation report. We're gonna need it anyway for licensing. So this is another large classroom. Now this classroom actually goes into another hallway. Well, Alex, I'll show you guys okay. later. But yeah. You send me this video as well. Yes. Yeah, so. Okay. This might be locked. We usually kept this locked. I don't know if it's still locked. Yep, it's locked. Okay. What is that guy? It goes into that other hallway space. Can you open it? Yeah. Is this 90B? Yeah. This is 90B. Look how much higher, look how much higher the ceilings go up. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. Are you sure the ceiling height is only 20 feet in here, man? This, this, this is, uh, oh, you're all the way up there? Yeah. This side of the building is 20, 21, 22, maybe? I know for K1 speed, we wanted 22. Yeah, you said it was only like 19. Is, uh... Any progress on that with 10 bone? Uh, no. I don't think K1 wants to come here, honestly. They do. They just have a messed up contract. Yeah, but the, those are the guys that have the contract. I know. I was the one that advised them to get them to sign that contract, which is why they have a stronghold in this area. Yeah, so... Be, which is why K1 Speed Guy got fired. I hear you. <laughs> so I made my own monster. <laughs> it doesn't want to open. All right, we'll just go around. It's all cool. Yeah. It goes around. We'll just go around. <laughs> okay. So now we're going to go to the classroom to the left. Oh, the lights are not working in here, but it's a big classroom. This, one? this is a really big classroom. I'll just walk it just to give you an idea. I'm still walking, still walking. I'll show you perspective wise. It's a big classroom. Yeah, it looks like about the same size. Yep. This is, this is the biggest classroom. Is it bigger? Yeah. Okay, this it, maybe it's big. Bigger. No, it's not as big as the first one we saw. Okay, you got it? But it's big. I got it. All right. Okay, okay. you good, sir? Okay, here's another classroom here. And it could be because the doors have been closed, it's not being used or whatever, if the AC's off, but there's definitely going to have to be some. There's water like right there in the ground. Yeah, this is wet. This is actually wet right now. So maybe a because we did have heavy rain yesterday. I think it might be the AC. Oh. Yeah, well, that's, that's, that's even scarier. That's, you can smell it in the room. No, the floor's wet, I just touched it. Okay. This is another classroom here. Yeah, this bathroom has been here for like almost a year and a half. <laughs> so, okay. Pretty much it looks like the same as we go down the hallway. Mm -hmm. This side of the building just probably needs some. Okay, so this hallway there, remember when I was in the auditorium and I said the door goes into a hallway? Yeah, that was the This door. is the hallway. So okay. let me show you, because in this hallway... It's a two-month project to get this. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is actually an IT electronics room. There's a bunch... Of, if you can open that, that'll be great, well, but that's this is, where... This is 90D or B? I'm not sure. But this is where all the breakers are. I mean, little expenses, like we have to number all the doors and stuff like that, because <laughs> all that stuff is not going... Yeah, this was the technology room. See, all the power conduits are here. Okay. All right. Then in, be thank you, Kyle. Then over here, this was another room, but we use this for storage. I'll show you the size of space there. Kyle has a key here. The way they keep this place is just mm -hmm. so stupid. I know. Trust me. I felt like a janitor. I, I used to be here. I, I would be assigned on campus to assist the staff and everything once a week. Mm -hmm. And um, so I had keys to everything. And I was mitigating issues. All right, while Kyle looks for that key, I'm going to show you this classroom here. This is another classroom here. Now, this is the hallway that goes into the auditorium. This could also break out into the auditorium if we wanted to do, like, something different and special. But remember, if we're going to put daycare classes in here, or even if it's elementary classes, but the daycare, we need these sinks. 
Right. So there's little things like that. We're yeah. gonna. So that's the part of what he's saying. We need to write down, and they're willing to put the cost in. Right. Can you hear that? He's saying if we're gonna do use on classes, yeah. um, this rooms for classes, but daycare will use this thing. So yeah, but I'm recording, so I, everything I'm saying is being recorded. Next, the next He's got to find the key. Yeah, this, this one on. It's all right. It's just a store. Definitely got to fix this door now because oh, I'm, no, not, that door not, came off. I'm not that strong. I'm not that strong. All right. I see him, TSU. Oh. Thank you. So now we're back into the... So you see the space. Story. That's where we went in, and this yeah. is where we're coming out now, right? Okay. 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 It gets confusing if you don't. This so I'm trying to walk it to you through through it to you a different a different way. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it to the boys and girls bathroom, the restroom, yeah, the restroom which is going to take us back to the other side so we can finish the other classrooms. Okay. Okay. Now, like I told you guys before, when I was here prior, there was an issue with the bathrooms flooding. So we need to get that corrected. Okay. So this is the staff only section, right? This is storage for the bathroom. This is where my janitorial people kept everything. It's okay. locked now. The boys in the girls room are yeah. basically the same, but let's As go girls. through this way. Yep. Right. Boys. But they, this cuts across to the hallway with all those classrooms, the long hallway, okay? okay. So let me show you. Come on. Now, as it relates for the daycare, we may have to convert one or two of these stalls the lower. into the smaller yeah. kitty bathrooms, right? But, you know, adults and kids are not supposed to technically share bathrooms. Right. So that's part of our cons construction situation that we have to sort of mitigate. Also going to need sinks in yes. those classrooms. In those classrooms, yes. Those and, and when I spoke with my, Mr. O'Neill and, and Kyle Wade, they said that there's, there's enough plumbing and everything there to put sinks in these rooms very easily. The plumbing plan is very good here. And then this is, if you look here, this is the boys' side. You know, the boys' side is always not as nice as the girls' side. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why that is. Yeah. Yeah. So the urinals, some closed bathrooms, but this is the boys' side. Okay? Okay. Little things that I would do to make this look so much better, besides paint, but like, you know. But the bones are really good in here. As long as that water situation. So my, my you know, that's my whole thing. So we're going to go back a little bit because... Remember that entrance where you were parked when you called me? Mm -hmm. You were parked right out here. Okay. So this would be the entrance to the playground. Okay, this is the playground. Yeah, okay. but let's go back and finish these classrooms that we didn't see yet. Okay. Okay, so this is another electrical room. Okay, this is another electrical storage room here. Okay. Okay. All right. Wow. And then... That's the hallway we just left, but we did not check these classrooms. So I want to show you these classrooms first. So this classroom is a double door. This was our computer lab room. Oh, yeah, I'm the computer lab. Yes. Okay. It's really a, a laptop lab, to be honest with you, the way it's the setup. Okay. So if you come out, of, if you come out this way, there's the hallway we went through. And then we came back around to go to the, uh, to the auditorium. Okay. But we... we I think we saw this classroom. Yeah, we saw this classroom. This was the next classroom we did not see. This is a. This is a very. This used to be a dance, a dance room. You okay. It's very big. This one. This is very very big. So if you notice this paint wall here, when I came in here a few years ago, this entire wall was all glass. Okay. But I had smelled something bad, so I had the janitor break the glass, and we found black mold. Yeah, so you could see the paint splotches yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. So we have to just make sure we check on that. Okay, for the sake of the kids. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. All right. So now we're going down the hallway. This is the aspect I was telling you about as it relates to where the kids would have access to the playground. Okay. okay, so now what happens is there's another, so this was also a lobby entrance fee. So like, for example, when we did K through fifth, they came through here, security was posted right here. The kids checked in, the buses went around the circle, around the playground, and that's where the kids were let off, okay? So right across the street, right across that street there, you see there's the playground, okay? 
The blue part of the playground is the part that Michael, uh, Mike O'Neill is going to be using for parking. So it's just the first half that's closest to the school that we'd be utilizing for the playground. Well, why do they have to do that? Um, take the because Amazon yeah. came in the arm and a leg for the parking space. You guys are probably going to want to buy new playground equipment, right? Yeah, we yeah, have that in absolutely. The, we have that in the business plan. That would be on tenant. Yeah. Yeah, we have that. So listen, uh, Kyle, show me where the oh, playground sure. ends and starts here for us. Like, what part are you guys taking? Is it just the blue tarmac part, or is it... I'm just curious. Like, all the space, and they have to take into the playground? Like, yeah. that makes it's already, sense. The because parking lot is rented already. I try to negotiate still. I wouldn't stop trying. You know what I mean? Because, yeah, and that's going to cut into the number of kids that we can have if we don't have enough playground um, space. Well, I'll tell no, you right now, even 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 if we just took this part right here, oh, we have more than most, most schools. There's plenty of playground space because you're able to... You're able to rotate your children in and out. You don't have yeah. to have a large playground spacing. So now, the so only this, issue with so that is that you guys get the keep. distance from the building. Okay, yep. the distance from the building. Let me show you. It's not it's even right It's here. not even like 30 feet. feet. And this okay. is broken up into four quads. Yeah, this is four quads. Yeah, keep two. Okay. So we're keeping two quads. So one half of this space. And then, and then the other part becomes your parking. Yeah. Is it is it our parking or... or? Yeah, yeah it becomes your parking. Spaces. Okay, so they're going to get... Because that's like all... That's, that's all Amazon. That's all Amazon. Yeah. And and then around to, and then around to the front, the only parking that we have left, like Amazon's even going to come over here too. Yeah. So the this this space here... The entire building is, is up in the front. All right, so I need okay. you to send me that because... Can you, if, yeah, send us that. Graph. I need the parking yeah. space for our licensing. So we're going to have then, that parking back Kyle, there. Kyle, I'm doing the marketing. Right, so what you need to do, if, if you don't mind, I want to have a meeting with the... HR mark of, of Amazon because if they're picking up their vehicles here, they could drop their kids off here too for our daycare. Could be a nice little marriage. Oh yeah, it's a good idea. Yeah. And then, but my thing is, they're still gonna keep what, this. What like the, the Amazon drivers? Drivers yeah. could pick up. Kids. No, because they drive no, their no, car no, here, they, can, they park their car and take their Amazon truck. Personal kids. So if they if the driver wants to drop off a kid in the morning for daycare Great to go idea. to work, that's like ninety. That's ninety employees right there. It's an excellent idea. Yeah. I'm, so I'm sure more than half of them the have kids. Right here, though, right? Yeah. So then yes. we can use for parent pickup. Yes. Because this, this, so we're gonna have this whole loop here. This is gonna be closed off, right? Like, like. Yeah, we can close kids. it up. That's yeah. Security. Okay. Yeah, security. Write that down. This way, there's not. Okay. And then what they're saying is the opposite side of this would be parking so for us to use. Started, yes. So it's no longer. Um, it was over there. It's yeah, because security. they want to keep the parking there. on the right and the parking on the left. Let's walk over there so you yeah. get a good video of it. Yeah. So we're gonna keep the two quads up front, and the back two quads will go and for parking. Space. For parking. Did you hear that, guys? Um, so they're gonna limit the. the you gotta take these two. Gonna, um, it's four two quads right now. No, the two fronts we need. So the ones closest. Use the two, um, yeah. Front. Same thing. Yeah. yeah. And then they're gonna use the back, the rear. And then the back ones would be parking for us. To put in this black tire, the tire crowning. The square footage. Yeah, we're going to make, I'm going to show that to you next, Debbie. So we'll have these two and an indoor playground. What's the square footage of these two? Um, oh, it's huge. We have it on that thing. Oh, it's, I, on, the, yeah. it's on the... Um, I could probably yeah. estimate it. Oh, yeah, it's it. at least 10,000. Yeah, you oh, got tons of space. This this is, that's 10,000? At least. You got tons of this space. Is okay. yeah. This is bigger than the auditorium. Okay. Yeah. This is bigger than the auditorium. Okay. Your playground, I have four friends with playground space I'm mean, playground I mean in schools daycares, and they literally have a very small playground area. maybe like that they have a space like, like that over 100 <laughs> wait kids. yeah one second so um would um say that again Belinda you have to have a separate play area for uh, toddlers infants toddlers to two year olds and then for preschool for two to six Exactly. Separate playgrounds. Okay. Yeah, we could have a, but we can have an indoor playground though for that, right? Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Yeah. And you can rotate it. So you can make a section for the primary, the littler, younger kids. You can make a actual section with yeah. just the different fencing. You could break and up then you the, can break it up. So what so Janelle's okay. basically saying is the space okay. that we have on the two on the on the two quads, separated. we could turn those two quads into three different age group playgrounds. Gotcha. Yeah, and you can yeah. rotate your kids yeah. into different areas. Yeah. I have, I have a good thought. If like if, if you guys have the front two, and then there's a way to get around the back, we could turn this area here. We can't. We need this for parking. We need, we need this, this for parking. Have parking. The parents need to have to uh, legally to drop, off. drop off the yeah. kids as close as possible. Drop them off in the back. They have to walk in. 
Got you. Oh, okay. Yeah, so this could be, yeah. Okay. Like, okay. Right. All right. So, Close this off. let me let me talk to her for a second. Yeah. Yeah. yeah See, but they've been doing this for over fifty years. So but if you do, but if you do that, what happens when we go K two five? You got to be careful. You need the buses to come through here if that happens. And, and also, trip. if you if you have a field trip or if parents are coming through, if you want to expand, you're eliminating because the parking lot is being sold. The, the parking lot is rented right now by Amazon. You see the green cones? It's you. Yes, they have. So what they're saying is the the loop around. The playground. And that's not a parking space, though, Joe. No, no, no. They're converting the other half into parking. So I know, but where, where are you standing right now? Where are you standing right now? This is where you're standing right now. Yeah, but where this, where where I'm standing right now is where the kids were dropped off or 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 or, or picked up in the morning, we're in the afternoon. Whatever they want but we'll do talk with about it, it later. It's theirs. Yeah, we'll talk about it. It's whatever you guys want to do but at the end of the day. But I'm just, I'm telling you how we did it and why, based on the legal things that I experienced with this facility. Joel, do you right, want to get a right, side right, background so they can see the area space of it? We'll take yeah. a picture right yeah, now. We'll take a visual. Um, I have a question. What about the space with the, where the picket fence is? The white picket fence? White picket fence? Yeah, for you know where the. That's not our thing, man. Let's take care. That's no, patches, but the patches are moving over here, so we might yeah. be able to take it. Yeah. That's what I'm just saying. We need to get as much um, space. What picket fence? It's on the side. You can put a little jungle gym in here, too. No, 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 no. That's, 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 let me show you from the inside, Belanger. Oh, that, right here. Yeah, yeah that's, that's, uh, that's connected not, to patches. That's, that's not, not possible. Side. That's not, that's not no, that that's section. Not no, that's patches. So, patches that's, like on the side? Yeah. yeah, so ours, this our right space here. literally ends at this door. You see oh. this door here? This yeah. door is a long hallway, which is the divider of our space and Patches' space. Okay, yeah, so like this was this was a small kids' playground right here. We could use this. Okay. Potentially, if Patches doesn't want it. Yeah, this. Yeah, yeah. Can we could use right, this. Okay. This would be a good space for the two. Yeah, you see, instead of going there. Yeah, but Patches yeah. might want it though. I'm telling they you now, it, yeah. they might want it. But, yeah. but this this because this is the long hallway that's connected from our space and their space. But I'll show you the long hallway. That's behind the auditorium stage. I'll show it to you. But when you hit yeah, the map in the, the video, uh -huh. you'll get it all in perspective. It took me months to memorize this thing, okay? I'm not gonna remember it, that's all <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. What it is, is it's so empty and so big, it looks smaller, but this is huge. Think about it, look at that playground right there. If you go to a, a gated community, usually they just have that. We can literally put one, two, three, four, five, six, and then another row, it's huge. But you can't see it right now because there's nobody in it, you know? Yeah. It's okay. huge. Yeah, it's a really big space. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it's like a... Absolutely. And you can rotate your kids from one section to another section okay. to the other section. Okay. So what we did here, this is interesting too. What we did here, this is the indoor playground side I was talking about potentially. There's a door that comes out here and this was a fenced in courtyard. Mm. So we made this like an outdoor like eating an area for the kids yeah. that was yeah. fenced in and it's, and it's outside. You know what I mean? Right. Or it's a good waiting area for the kids that are waiting for mom and dad. Right, you know what I mean? Because they'll come here and pick them up, right? They won't. Not for daycare. They have to go. Not in, for daycare. I'm talking about if we're going to go to K yeah. through fifth because we're doing 15 years. So yeah. on a 15 year lease, we're going to grow. Huh? You have to make one at lunchroom. Listen, um, one of those big we can make one of those jobs. Like, no. you see the dance? Uh, oh, wait, you had a question about the kitchen, right? Um, Behind the stage. I'll show you. I'm going to go there. Okay. But the increased one they can be eaten. Sandra, I miss you, girl. What happened? Um, girl. But when you go up to the stage, then they have lunch. It's a good job. All right, so this is the room right here. Now, remember, we just walked in, right? This is the room right here that I was saying would be a great indoor playground, but it also acted as the cafeteria for the school. So you'll see the locker room. So we made this a cafeteria, but this would be an ideal. Like would be a cafeteria. Yeah, you could do that too. But yeah. this, this, the auditorium, the auditor, that means it'll be used every single like day. Yeah. 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 Is that restroom back there? Yes, they are. That's why it's okay. a great. Is that the door for? That's outside? the door to go outside. That's the door that that's that's allow us to use that space. Um, then that would be. No, that room. would be our space. No, oh. this is our no, space. this is the one that I was telling you. Oh, so this is the one. one the yes, yeah. this is the one I was telling you. So, like the high schoolers, could, they were allowed to eat out here if they didn't want to be around the younger kids, right? Okay. So, so this is a little outdoor um, area. Oh yeah, that's big too. Wow. Yeah. That's, yeah, the babies are right here. 
There you go. That's even safer, right? Storage. And this was this was a storage closet slash office. This is another. Just, just this area itself could be a daycare. Exactly. <laughs> just this area could be a daycare. Yeah. Absolutely. So now we're going to move forward some more. You're leaving the lockers and everything, right? Yeah. You're not taking anything out of here. We'll, we're good. We'll, we'll leave whatever yeah. you want. Yeah. This is the entrance, another entrance into the lobby. And then here's the bathroom in here. There were some plumbing issues in this bathroom, so we'll figure that out. But... So there's one here. You can literally make oh, okay. this. They do have the lower yeah, areas. the little ones here. Because mm -hmm. this was this. And then, Debbie. Yes. And then, if you come through this hallway, this is the other bathroom. Okay. This is the bathroom. Yep. I told you this was. This is even better than the first one we were looking at because this allows us to grow up if we put the sinks in the classrooms. Of course. Because that's what I'm trying to tell them. We're, yes, we're setting it up as a daycare now, but if we go K through fifth, we're going to need number, the sink. Yeah, we're going to need the footprint as it is. Okay? It just needs a little love. Mm -hmm. That's it. And I think brighter walls. It's a little muted. Is that sink adult height? Yeah, those adult highs for now. Yeah. Okay. Got it. Thank you. All right, so we're going to go right. So now, oh, I'm getting my steps in. All right, here's what we're going to do, guys. So now we're going to we're gonna go through behind the stage. I want to show you this. Right? <laughs> so remember I said this is behind the stage? Okay, so Debbie, remember we went into the bathroom here and we cut across? Yeah. So this was the last door yeah. when I was referencing the video between Kyle and the pole. So there's like a hallway. Yeah. yeah. Okay. okay so, so that's where the playground stage. is. Yeah. There's the bathroom. Now we're behind the stage, right? right? Behind the stage. Can we turn the light on? Uh, Let's see which, one switch. Entrance, which one is your light entrance, Kyle? Uh, the lights. There's one in front of you, Joe, right here. Oh, okay. Right here. Okay, well, there's stairs okay, here. Can, I'm going to show, show you around, but there's stairs there. But so this is the backstage. So I want to show you a couple of things. Okay. This right here, this is the hallway behind the stage, and then there's there's another hallway here. Thank you. Okay. Oh, okay. There's another hallway over there. Okay. So that's behind the stage, but that's also like the green room. Like gotcha. you have a, a, a pass or an act yeah. before it goes in, right? This is a storage closet that's always closed for some reason before okay. we could ever find a key. But this is a pretty big storage closet. Okay. Um, then remember when I told you patches might potentially take that playground? Mm -hmm. And it would end at that door. Okay. That door. Oops. If you come here, come with me. That door is at the end of this very long hallway. Okay. Remember I told you outside that very long hallway? Yeah. This okay. is that door. And then, and then the there door. was a fence and I said patches might take it. Yeah. This side would be patches side. Oh. This is the side we were looking at before. Oh. Oops, so, so who's patches again? Yeah. Yes, yes. So they're taking this. Patches does um, daycare for terminally ill babies. So why do they do this way? Where did that way before? They're inside the mall. Yeah, but they weren't they further out? They, no, they need to be. They want to be away from everyday traffic because these kids have so air they're tanks. Moving their location. They're moving from inside the mall to this side. Okay. Yeah. So that's why it was taking time for them to kind of figure out how they're going to logistically do this and help Patches. Patches has been a long-term tenant, and the cause is huge. Yeah, I, I understand. Can you imagine evicting them? Yeah, I oh understand. my god! Oh, no, of course. <laughs> that's bad press. You know what I mean? This was the this was the rec room. So under against my pastor's advisor at the time that I was consulting, this was actually a break room with a kitchen and three sinks. He took it all out and put this here. So um, we'd have to check to see if we can make this a food prep area, because then yeah. if we do do K through five and we do the, um, the, food, program. the food program, that's $7 a kid per day. All you have to do for food prep, you just have to turn it to three sinks. You have to have your mm -hmm. three sinks. You already have your GFI outlet. Yep. You already have a dishwashing area. And you can do top um, so you don't have to have 
Okay. Oops, sorry. So this bathroom here is a completely marbled out bathroom. This was the pastor's bathroom. He's decked out. It's all marble. Nice. I don't know if you could open that, but that's nice. So this, this, this was his office. This was his office waiting room. Which would act, this would act as the green room. Like if I'm doing a show or a concert here, this would be the, there's a nice bathroom, this and that, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, he had his own key, he did. I doubt you'll be able to open it. If you can, that's great. Okay. So this was his office. Yep. So which should be the green room, right? We still need to, we were supposed to put a stage here so they can go right up. But you can get into the stage from behind here too. Okay. okay? All right, so let's move forward. And we are back where we started. So that's the whole tour. Okay. It's about 15,000 steps. Are you sweating? I'm sweating. Yeah, that's <laughs> we needed that. I needed it. I did. So that's it. But the size of it all, because it's empty, you don't feel it. But look, look at Sandra. Yeah, walk. We walk hey, we did... Look hey, at that, Sandra. Gentlemen. I had your Kaylin car in here. Welcome, 480 welcome, people. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yeah. yeah. Oh, one heads up. They told me, uh, Chris and, and Belanja, they wanted, because of the way the stage is, they wanted uh, handrails. Oh, because kids. Okay. Yeah. Um, so they wanted handrails. But this was custom build outs. I ordered the screens. These screens here, I'm the one that ordered them. And yeah, I got an We stole all the, we, we didn't steal, but we borrowed from the dump sites all the uh, driftwood. That was free wood. Yeah. Driftwood. We took them off of uh, pallets, old pallets. Mm. Really nice. Yeah, didn't it come out nice? Yeah, beautiful and different. Yeah. They were restored. They were all old pallets that were going to go to the trash. So nice. we made a design out of it. Yeah, the whole thing, the whole stage, we did that with the that with the old pallets. Cool. Neat idea. And we used it, we used a group of guys from a drug recovery program, oh, wow. and I was part of their ministry to help fix the stage here. So uh, I, I, I'm not sure he's talking to Ashley about these screens. She says that she talked to someone that thinks they can fix it. It's not. You can try, but you can't. Yeah. I, I did all the research in the it's three and a half months. First of all, we bought this from um, um, GovDeals. The problem is that equipment and that technology is 25 years old. Mm -hmm. They don't even make the replacement parts. Yeah. So in order to fix it, you have to get the actual parts from a working unit, which nobody uses these anymore because an LED screen will do the same exact thing for yeah, a quarter of the price. Take that screen area and have a phenomenal. Yeah, but phenomenal yeah, content. we've tried. It's and it was so bright, it was like hard to even sit in the front row. It was too much, the, that particular one. Because it's made, that, those were screens that if you're on a football field outside, it lights up. Oh, okay. So he put it in here thinking, oh, it's a great price. And then when the lights turned on, it didn't, it didn't like we couldn't put patterns on it. But it was so bright wow. that you couldn't sit in the front row. Oh, so, okay. but yeah, this is the space, man. It's a great space. I'm really excited yeah, about it. Probably it'll take about two two months, maybe a little more to get make it like habitable. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But, um, yeah. In order to be ready for inspection. Not, we have all the needs and things like that. Yeah, we're gonna yeah. put and together we'll a list. Send you guys, our proposal. Go yeah. From there, you okay. can go to LOI. And then yeah. From there, go to lease. Okay. Okay. All awesome. Right. Very good. Thank you, Kyle. I appreciate yeah. you, man. I got my work on it. I'm signing off here, Chris.